During the play, uh, I was just trying hard, you know. But uh, I ended up bumping into a guy, and uh, he braced himself and pushed back on me as I was trying to make sure the pile didn't fall on me. But uh, as I fell, he was coming forward, kicked him in his helmet. I had no idea I would be ejected, but uh, the referee explained everything to me as he walked me off, and that was the case. It's uh, something you hate to see. Uh, I hurt the team, honestly, and I feel like um, if I can have it back, I would do things differently. But um, it was basically just a reaction. I couldn't really help myself. You saying you weren't trying to kick him in the head? No, sir. Were you trying to kick him at all? I didn't. I didn't even know he was falling towards me. But uh, as I hit the ground, I seen him. And yeah, my foot just made contact. It, I think it looked worse than it was, you know. Uh, Greg's very remorseful. Um, doesn't do us any good now. He understands what he did was wrong. Um, and that won't happen again. Have you ever been ejected before? No, I haven't. So did that make it even kind of more surprising to you that he was leading <laughs> you off the field? Yeah, I don't ever want to be labeled as a dirty player, you know. I, I work hard and I try my best to keep the game clean, you know, because I know sometimes we are targeted based off reputation, but uh, it's something that I can't control. All I can do is just play each play one play at a time. Could you apologize to the team in total at, at all? Well, I haven't had the opportunity to get everyone up front. I feel like it was just a quiet locker room after the loss. But um, here and there, I've seen a few guys, and they came in at halftime. I tried my best to encourage them and let them know that I let them down and basically apologize for it. Greg, it seemed like the Titans did a lot of talking, and it seemed like they were doing some stuff to, to bait you guys in a way. I know that's not